Hey, and welcome back to my blog of powerful lifestyle tips as we discuss the details of my new book, Parenting Through Puberty, published by the American Academy of Pediatrics. This is tip number two, the format and topics. In the book's three parts are topics related to adolescent growth, emotional development, and areas of health and wellness. We begin with the progression of physical changes. Have you been wondering when the right time will be to have that special talk with your daughter or exactly when your son will have his growth spurt? Use my timeline to know what you can expect next and when to expect it. Consider the nuances if you have a child who is an early or possibly a late bloomer. There's a whole lot to consider concerning self-esteem and body image, especially when it comes to the media. How can we effectively cope with this? These topics and many more are covered in part one. Why do level-headed teenagers make such irresponsible choices at times? Want to learn the latest fascinating information on the emerging adolescent brain? Have you worried about moodiness versus an anxiety or a depression disorder? How do we know the difference? Have you wished you could be a fly on the wall during those private time discussions that your pediatrician has with your child? Find out about all of this in part two. Health and wellness is the focus of part three. How do we help families struggling with obesity? How do we navigate puberty if we're raising a child with special needs? What is physical literacy and why is it so important? How do we help families achieve a healthy, active lifestyle? Please join me in about one week as I detail many of these and other topics in Parenting Through Puberty. To order your copy, please go to my website, Health Powered By You, and click on this link on the homepage. Bye for now, and don't forget to follow me on Twitter, like me on Facebook, and share me with all your friends and family.